I feel like anytime you can have queso and guacamole and margaritas, you should. There's a laid back nature to Texas that's not necessarily in New York. So when we have a dinner party in New York, we seat people because I think it's good for conversation, but we also want it to be super laid back for people to feel like they can take their shoes off, that they can spill, that it's fun, and that it's you know a low key night. I like to choose what the meal is gonna be. So it depends on the night. You know, If we're having a night where we serve Mexican food, I think queso is terrific. And I also love a cheese plate. A beautiful cheese plate is very easy to make. I mean, you don't have to make anything. You just prepare it. There's some, some preserves of some sort, some fancy preserves that looks like you made it, but you didn't. And then the greatest cheeses. I mean, I like to find a truffle cheese. If I die and somebody buries me in a truffle cheese, I'll be perfectly happy. That would be my last meal, just a large truffle cheese and some crackers. Um, but truffle cheese is my go-to for sure. But then also, you know, something that's a little bit harder like a manchego and then a, a goat cheese and then some honey, some truffle honey. You can never overdo the amount of truffle. And then um, some great crackers. It's not that hard. And then a pimento cheese if you're in the South, of course. Pimento cheese is a go-to. We want it to feel like people can have a really fun night, that there's dancing, the great music. And we usually start slow in the Willie Nelson area and then towards the end there's some Tupac because people like to dance or some Pitbull. We definitely don't take ourselves too seriously as Texans.